For against all the 19th century, 19th, 20th, and 21st century attempts to blur the line between body and spirit in accounts of Swedenborgian angelology, Balzac's Seraphita does die. Minna and Wilfred see her soul ascend to God and her dead body remains. What Balzac wants to convey in all of this about Swedenborg or mesmerism, angels or humans, the material and the spiritual realms, none of that is clear to me. Yet there is no gain saying the decidedly otherworldly nature of Seraphita's desire and her essential nature. Life on earth is treated throughout the novel as a trial and a hardship for the angel, or almost angel, as Seraphita, as Seraphita may be a human who has attained angelic androgyny and is just on the verge of a fully spiritual angelic status conferred only with death. 